study and read a book about insects. This is um, the body parts of an insect first, and then I'll do the book. Okay, so an insect has a head. The next body part I'm going to draw is the thorax. Say thorax. And the last word is kind of fun to say. Abdomen. Abdomen. Head, thorax, abdomen. Two antennas. Six legs. One, two, three, four, five, six. This could be all different kinds of insects. Kind of, this one kind of looks like an ant, but if I, a lot of insects have wings. If I add wings, it might look different. Different types of wings. Maybe this kind of wing. That makes it look different also. Okay, our song that goes with it, I will sing. And it goes, head, thorax, abdomen, abdomen, head, thorax, abdomen, abdomen, two antennas, six squiggly legs, head, thorax, abdomen, abdomen, head, thorax, abdomen, abdomen, head, thorax, abdomen, abdomen, two antennas, six squiggly legs, head, thorax, abdomen, abdomen. All right, so our story is going to be about a certain kind of insect. This is a beetle. There's all different kinds of beetles, not the one on the cover. Beetles have a head, thorax, abdomen, but then they have this protective shell that covers up their thorax and abdomen. And if they open up the shell, underneath are hidden wings. I love beetles. A beetle is an insect, and there are many different kinds of beetles. Look at all those beetles. Big ones, little ones, some have horns. Beetles live almost everywhere in the world. Most beetles live on the land. But some beetles live in the water. That one's swimming, that beetle. He's swimming in the water. Beetles have wings. Most beetles can fly. Remember I told you they open up their shell and underneath their wings. Most can fly. Does that mean all of them? No, but almost all of them, most. Look at the pattern on those wings. Beautiful. Some beetles are very large. The largest beetle in the world is called the Goliath beetle. It does not live here. It's really cool. Look at that. It's gigantic. Goliath beetle. Beetles eat many things. Many beetles eat plants. See that? You might think, well, that doesn't look like a beetle, but that is a stage. That's that larva stage. And if you look on our Google Classroom, you'll see that Jane had posted that she's going through the um, cycle of ladybugs. So they'll go from a larva to a pupa, to the um, actual beetle. So that is a stage. Look at, look at that. Beetles are many colors. Ladybugs are red with black spots. Mm -hmm. Ladybugs are a kind of beetle. I love to hold ladybugs or have them crawl on me. 
They are an insect. You're having an insect crawl on you. Head, thorax, and the abdomen is covered by this polka dot shell. Two antennas, six legs. One, two, three, four, five, six. Head, thorax, abdomen, abdomen. Head, thorax, abdomen, abdomen. Two antennas, six squiggly legs. Head, thorax, abdomen, abdomen. Ladybug. Some beetles glow in the dark. Fireflies glow in the dark. And fireflies are a type of beetle. Here's the larva stage. It glows. And I like the ending because this is a summary that um, closes out the book. So it says, beetles are interesting insects. Beetles are interesting. So these children are observing the fireflies inside of a jar. They're just watching carefully. So it's fun to observe beetles. This week, we're gonna work on insects. So one of your papers set is like a report and you're gonna make a report about beetles. You wanna know my favorite insect? Okay, I'll show you. Let me hide for a sec. Put it on my cape. My favorite, I like ladybugs a lot. But my favorite is the butterfly. Because the colorful designs, I love butterflies. Kind of all kinds of insects too. Okay, have a great week and work very hard, friends. I'm proud of you. Keep it up. Bye.